Well, folks, uh, seems like a lazy Sunday afternoon here in downtown Baltimore, and I feel like I'm hosting an episode of Talk Stoop, but it's all good because I'm here right now uh, promoting the ACW show coming out sometime next month and maybe just a couple more weeks. So go to Adrenaline Championship Wrestling on Facebook to check it out because this is the man right here, the heavyweight champ. Kindred. He will be defending his title against the holy, un the unholy enigma, the King of Maryland himself, Skull. And Kindred, man, how you feeling, bro? I'm good. How you doing? Man? I'm pretty. I'm pretty good, man. I mean, this is going to be such a uh, big contest. Is this the first time you and uh, Skull ever, ever gone at it one on one? Uh, yeah, actually, this is my first time actually wrestling Skull. And, uh, I've seen him around a lot. That live at work, so I'm actually pretty excited to go on. And, uh, it should be a good match, but uh, as you can see, I'm the heavyweight champion. Yeah. And uh, October 4th, I'm going to become, and I'm still a heavyweight champion. So. And pretty much when you're looking at an opponent that you've never faced before, and this is a young man who has come up just like yourself, both of you guys are right now at the top of your your respective divisions. Skull, who is, of course, a former light heavyweight champ and former uh, cruiserweight champ and so many, and, so, and junior heavyweight champ, so much that he has done in his division, and now winning the King of Maryland, he is uh, definitely the number one contender for your title. So when you're looking at an opponent like him with such unbelievable uh, abilities, what kind of plans do you have to to counter any of his his high flying moves and his uh, technical ability that that's called does that. Uh, I have a lot of things. I have a bad part of you know, We are always superior to people who just like you know, make it feel like they uh, can beat us. Uh -huh. But uh, I have a lot of strength. I have you know I'm smart. I'm very smart. Okay. You know what I'm saying? Somebody like Skull, I'm not gonna take anything from him. he's a phenomenal person. Um, work wise he's awesome. You know, so I'm just gonna go in there, do me, you know, beat him, all by the still be champion just like I came in. So that's pretty much my strategy. Yeah. So now once you have this task uh behind you, I'm assuming, what other challenges do you have coming up uh for this bill? Um any. You know, uh, we have a lot of good couple of shows coming up even after this one. Um, so uh, I wrestled uh, Black G's, the one before this one. Right. So I mean that was a really good challenge for me. Yeah. It made me kind of step up my game a little bit. Yeah. And uh, I physically like I never really had like a match where it was more physical uh, other than when I wrestled Drolix, but I didn't have that match that was really physical. So when I wrestled Black G's. It was a uh, it was a uh, real physical, but I wanted to prove to G's that I am. ACW champion, mm -hmm. you know, I'm worried to hold this belt, yeah. and I can go toe-to-toe -to -toe with somebody in this caliber, yeah. you know, I, I can do so much now that I'm ACW champion, and not most where I had it back then, I didn't really have, I didn't feel like I had a challenge, right. you know, so, uh, these next couple of matches with me, I'm sure it's going to be, you know, stack the bar each time, so. Yeah, the contention uh, in ACW is uh, pretty much stacked, like you said, and being that you are the champion, it's a little bit different than going after it and facing your opponents who have faced you before without, without the titles. Yeah, I mean, like, I mean, before, I mean, I was still, let me say, young in business, but I really didn't have, like, I had an idea, I just had a direction for it. And once I started bringing the direction and vision for where I want to go, where I want to be, you know, everybody wants to be a wrestler, yeah. But what are you wrestling for? Right. You know what I'm saying? I mean, even if I didn't have this championship, I'll still be the man. Right. So, I mean, that that was my thing when I started out. And um, once I became the champion, now I was like, okay, now I'll be able to set myself in the bar now and challenge myself. So, that made it Ladies and gentlemen, this is the ACW Heavyweight Champion, October the 4th, Friday, October the 4th, Millersville, Maryland, OBI building. Stay tuned, folks, because right now we're going to just segue into Dr. D's 101, where you'll have to see for yourself an in-depth interview of the man himself known as Kendrick.